So today's Beyblade topic, we're going to be talking about Chao Shin, Beyblade's playboy, the man who just permanently walked around with like 50 hoes at any given time. So we meet Chao Shin while the team is in China, and Masamune is wrecking everybody, but Chao Shin just comes and destroys him for no reason, and Bro just has three chicks and is wearing sunglasses inside the Bay Park. Why do you need sunglasses? Oh, you saw the way he was walking, though! But Masamune wasn't about to let that strike launch disrespect slide, so homie, the people's champion is not about to let homie walk away. Way just like that, but what the people's champion was not expecting was all the TikTok fanboys this man Chao Shin has. Bro summoned a whole little gang of eight year olds to bully our American hero Masamune. But then Chao Shin really says, I don't care, and walks off with his little gang of chicks and goes and gets some sodas that he calls drinks and then he pours it on Masamune. That's some disrespectful crap, my guy. And Masamune is not gonna let that slide. Homo's like, Battle me, but Chao Shin pretends like he's gonna faint on some hoe crap, but then the Shyan, a true. True Menace appears and starts talking crazy to Chao Shin. He's like, are you really that much of a hoe? You're gonna run away from the American kid? Can you not handle the Takis? Are you scared that if you lose, you'll lose all your hoes too? Chao Shin was like, nah, gee, let's battle on the freaking Great Wall of China. Then somewhere across China, we learned that Chao Shin beat Mei Mei without even trying. Omi was texting and making TikToks while he beat Mei Mei. And I know we gotta talk about how annoying Chi Yoon was. I see your comments, my guy. We gonna get to it sometime next week. Okay. Bro had a whole squad of cheerleaders at any given time, even on the Great Wall of China. Bro had like, what, 30 of them right there? I, I think it's the hair my guy. Bro had fire hair, not gonna lie. Anyway, so they start battling on the Great Wall of China, and Masamune is going in, but my man... Chao Shin is just chilling. Homie's pulling out some Tai Chi moves on the Great Wall of China. Look at him go! Tai Chi bullcrap going on right now. Bro said, nah, G, get wrecked into the wall, homie. And then he starts talking crazy to Masamune this whole time about he's not cool and he's cool. And then the cheerleaders. And then Chao Shin just up and takes off. Bro just vanished. Look at him. They're like running at 50 miles an hour. How are you doing this? You're not a super soldier. So after Masamune literally just can't hit this man, he finally figures out a way to start hitting my man's Beyblade. But then homie me pulls out some of the coldest crap I've ever seen in this show. The most divine Uno reverse card I have ever seen. But don't worry, the people's champion stays in the battle. But they are talking crazy right now. Masamune is like, I take this seriously and you don't, so I'm a win. And Chao Shin's like, ha, you're just a little boy, sit down, little homie. So then Masamune pulls out his special move and hits Virgo, sends him flying in the air. Oh, I'm sorry, her. Yes, his Beyblade is a Tai Chi chick. Anyways, the Cheyenne reappears. The menace is back to talk crazy to Chao Shin again. Bro is like, are you really gonna lose to this American kid? And Masamune is like, yes, he is. But Chao Shin is about to pull out some new special move Tai Chi bullcrap, but Masamune just has the main character syndrome so hard he's on the fake it till you make it. And right now, Homie was making it, but Homie made it a little too far and destroyed the whole thing. He self destructed. Bro just killed himself. So now we're at the World Championships. I think this is the first battle we see the World Championships is against the Chinese team, and Chao Shin is out here styling on everybody. Bro has the freaking fur coat, has his 50 cheerleaders in the crowd, all his fangirls and fanboys and they get right into battling and I know you saw how that Beyblade was looking a little bit different than before so Masamune goes right for the attack but gets sent flying and Chao Shun has to explain that homie actually dressed up his Beyblade for the world championships bro gave his Beyblade a whole new outfit to style on everyone bro changed out the fusion wheel so Chao Shun spawns his Tai Chi chick Beyblade and starts working Masamune for real homie's getting all over Masamune look at him he just yeeted Masamune back bro bro has the attack type Beyblade and bro's getting sent flying anyways so Masamune starts pulling out the whole I am the one, one point blah 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 I'm the main character so bro just breaks a piece off of Virgo and I call bullcrap because there ain't no way Masamune was strong enough to break a Beyblade ever in this show. But he starts going in. Homie thinks he's the main character again. Even Chao Shin's cheerleaders got concerned. And bro is working Chao Shin. He even got him going serious. Bro is really yelling over a Beyblade match. Bro just took off his jacket. I know they got the cheerleaders going a little crazy down there. Anyways, look at them all blush. Hey, yo, what's that motion she doing with What does Chao Shin be having her do? And I'm just like... So Chao Shin starts getting serious. I mean, look at my man. Homie is really getting into it. Has his Tai Chi chick going crazy with two swords. Look at her. Bro had the freaking spirit turn into a Beyblade. But it broke. 
and homie took an L, but that don't matter. All seven of his girlfriends rushed past security to tell him that it's okay and gave him a, a cloth, bro. Homie was really the people's champion, yanked that title right from Masamune, and bro is heated, bro. So a little later in the show, the team has Madoka heated because they can't train and no one is slick as freaking Chao Shin, bro. I just don't get it. Huh? Yo, how's it going, Madoka? Long time no see. Chao Shin? What are you doing here? Well, I just want to talk for a minute. That's okay, right? <laughs> Bro had her giggling within a matter of five seconds. Had these dudes questioning their whole life decisions. Bro was like, what did he do that I can't? Hmm, I wonder why. Bye!